Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. So I have a theory. I have a theory and I'm looking for your input to see what you guys think about this. So yesterday, Queefy Boy, from the uh, longest record of pretending to be busy, made it out of the woodworks and uploaded a video on his Truxton Arm Swing account. All right, no, Darius Arm Swing account, okay? And he's talking about Turbo Joe, 11 minute video, you know, and here's the thing, like it's clear as day that Darius Truxton and his army got buried by me and the snakes, right? They're, they're destroyed. They got destroyed and they're continuing to get destroyed. They've been humiliated. They've been exposed. Queefy boy, pictures of him at friggin' Blue Jays sitting alone like a loser that he is. No friends, no job, no car, no girlfriend. Okay, pathetic. Pictures of Queefy Boy at a game convention with a double XL shirt that says property of the game chasers on it. Literally a shirt that says he's a property of another man and he wears it with confidence. With a with the biggest smile I've ever seen on his face was in that picture. And here's my thing. <clears throat> it's been established that I basically sucked out his soul and sucked out all the energy that he ever had in ranting. And now when Darius Truxton makes rants, they suck, right? There's no energy, no charisma, no no humor anymore. He's not creative, he's just, he's just done. He's just had it, he's been exposed, 2772, alt account one destroyed him, he's done, right? Ran away for two months. So, my thing is, when he made that video, Darius, about me just recently, that was already trash. Everyone knows that rant was trash because he basically didn't even come up with anything new. Say, he has no energy. All right, we got it. Now, this rant he did yesterday about Turbo Joe, I have never seen a more pathetic rant from Darius than this. But I have a theory on this, okay? This is, this is what I'm thinking. And the funny thing is, we all agree that the rant is rant sucks, but there's people in the comments that are still trying to like give him that kind of confidence. It was like, yeah, that was great, yeah, great, great, great rant, blah blah blah. Still trying to, but yo, the, the the rant sucked. It was literally garbage. And my theory is, Queefy boy, you pathetic loser with a chinless from one angle, double chin from another. I think you're on purposely. Darius, you're on purposely sabotaging your own rants to let it be known to other people that, hey, you know what, guys? The old Darius is done. Now, just Darius, all he wants to do is cry on the internet, be a little loser, and watch cable TV and play his little Switch games, right? It, 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 I sensed it from his video yesterday. I sensed that he is on purposely now, even though when he tries his hardest, it's pathetic because he's been buried by me and been exposed, right? He's some loser that proposed to Ursha Gaming with Amiibo toys, right? He's some loser that uh, got beat it up, beat up, lifted up to the ground and knocked to the ground. And all he did as a defense mechanism was grab the guy's crotch, weird him out to make him stop. We know that. He's been exposed over and over and over again. And now what he's doing, this is what Darius is doing now. He's setting the standard out there in the precedent so that anytime he's going to do a rant where he's, remember, he's the rant king, right? Chief Debbie, Chief Debo, you loser. I thought you said Darius Truxton was the rant king, the king of rants, right, Albert Menenkak? Well, apparently not, because that video yesterday sucked. And he's on purposely now toning it down and sabotaging his own quote-unquote rants so that you people in the Truxton army get used to the fact that Darius Truxton is never going to do what he did before because he's gonna, he's been exposed and that the snakes have leverage over Darius Truxton. Whenever Darius Truxton gets out of line, right, what's going to happen? Coach Booge in 2772, pretty much, right? Dominoes again? Oh, and oh, I'm very sorry, Robert. You know, the combination of many things will happen again anytime Darius Truxton gets out of line. So now... He's letting it be known that every time he now talks about other people, it's just going to be a dumbed down, boring, no energy. I sensed it. Like, I can sense it from the video. He's on purposely holding back just to let it be known that all the old Darius is gone. Now he's going to turn into the new Darius live streaming. And here's another piece of proof for that. I'll tell you what. 
if you go to his uh, comment section, right, he does a rant, okay, a crappy rant, right? But then if you go into the comments, he comments and says, check out my live stream channel here. And then he links it to his live stream channel, the Darius Truxton Live once again. Why would he do that? Why would he on a crappy rant and then link his real live stream chat? Why? Because that's what he wants you to go to. He wants you to accept that that's his main channel, live streams, crappy games, and there's only three people in the chat, they see that racist piece of trash, see right here that other racist piece of trash, and then friggin' DJ Rudd in the autistic loser who, ha who has his wife getting tyroned, instead of actually attending his wife and taking care of her, he'd rather, DJ Rudden would rather drop everything to play Power Wash with Queefy Boy and James Campbell. That's what it is. I'm sorry, Albert. I'm sorry I had to do that to your lover boy, Darius, but he's destroyed. And he's on purposely now doing boring rants for you guys to stop bothering him. That's what I think's going on. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Because... There is no way his his rants are this crap now. They're so trash. They're so garbage. They're so boring. He had no energy. He was talking. He was even talking slow on purpose. Have you noticed that he was talking slow on purpose, holding back on purpose to bore you guys to death so that next time he rants, you, better, you gotta expect it. It's not gonna be that good. So you might as well go to his live stream and just watch him play crappy games. That's it. That's what I've noticed. And that's what Darius Truxton has been reduced to. A loser with no job, no car, no girlfriend, no life, no social life. All right. An admitted incel. Never had a girlfriend in his life. His father doesn't like him. His mom doesn't like him. His sister doesn't like him. Coach Booge doesn't like him. Sister's kids don't even know he's, he exists. He's never going to be invited to a Christmas dinner at Coach Booge's house, we know that, because Darius Truxton is gonna smell like weed, walk in there and corrupt the kids, we know that, right? Smell, also smelling like cat piss. He's got a friggin' dirty apartment with a dirty vent. And if you look in that video again, if you check that video, the one he made yesterday, the vent is out of shot again. It's out of the camera shot. Oh, what a coincidence, right? Yeah. Instead of actually cleaning the vent and living filth free, and showing the cam uh, the vent. He'd rather keep the vent dirty, be lazy, smell like cat piss, and take the vent out of the camera shot. What a pathetic loser. So that's what I think about Darius. He's on purposely doing boring, stale rants to get you guys used to the fact that he ain't never gonna go back to doing what he was doing to stop bothering him. So to, to stop saying my name in the live chat and getting, getting him ranting. That's what he's doing. That's what I think. What do you guys think? Now, Albert Menencock, let me say something to you, idiot. I, I, like, like, I see these notifications. You make these stupid videos on the Retro Gaming Community, review of the Atari Game Station, and then you're talking about PK in the universe cries about we... Wow, uh, for three hours, you got 11 views on the Atari Game Station. Wow. A round of applause. And then the, uh, the PK in the universe video, you got 16 views in three hours. Wow, round of applause there, too. Okay, round of applause. Yeah, you're, you're really making waves on YouTube there, uh, Albert. I'm glad you're reaching a big audience because everyone everyone does want to hear a five foot two shrimp prancing around the streets of Florida looking like Nosferatu fighting raccoons for muffins. Everyone wants to hear you. Which, yeah, I saw in the I saw in my com um that short I made yesterday on the sloth and the gray. Someone said that those sunglasses that Albert wears are definitely from the gas station. I agree with that. They're like no brand. Okay, the most cheapest sunglasses he's ever weared. Just crap. That shirt that uh, Albert has on probably hasn't been washed in weeks. He hasn't found the time to go to a Walgreens public uh, washroom to wash his clothes in the friggin' toilet uh, thing and then take a shower in the public sink. We know that. Hey, Newsflash Albert, you're creatively tapped, all right? Your content sucks, all right? Do yourself a favor and talk about me and put my name in the title and get views and then get, proceed to get buried by me and the snakes. That's your best bet. Because right now, this 11 views, 16 view stuff ain't going to cut it. 
You ain't gonna go nowhere. You're never gonna get monetized. You're never gonna e-bag and you're never gonna get money to buy that Kirby doll. Got it? So might as well put my name in the title so you can get that 100 to 200 views because we all know everyone just wants to hear you talk about me and the snakes. We all know that, right? You did say, Albert Menencock, that you were supposed to, oh, uh, many more DT burials on the way. Where are they? Where are your Darius Truxton burials that you promised us? That was three weeks ago that you made the last D DT burial. And then you in the video, high on fentanyl, was like, oh yeah, more on the way. Where are, I don't see them. They're nowhere to be seen because you're a cock and you still love Darius Truxton and you still go over to 2772, bend over and take it from Darius himself while his stupid bro cat Brooke watches. We know that. All right. So stop your stupid retro gaming community content. No one cares about your hot takes on the Atari game station. No one cares about your hot takes on Phoenix Resale. Just put my name in the title. Talk about me and let's keep this thing going. All right. Because if you don't keep it going, you're going to have your ugly Nosferatu 5'2 shrimp face, right? Your Popeye phone eye face in my thumbnail very soon. And you better listen because it's going to happen. And if you still don't do it, maybe one of your channels might disappear, right? What did you say yesterday? Oh, if anyone uses your content, we're going to lose a channel. It's not a false flag. It's a flag. Well, I got something better for you. If you don't do what I say and, and, and start acting like a cuck that you are, you're going to lose a channel. How do you like that threat? Huh? Yeah, that's what I thought. So sit there and shut up and there's nothing you can do about it except cry on the Internet.